While Pancho Villa was dominating northern Mexico, Emiliano Zapata was stirring up forces in the south. Zapata wanted land and freedom for rural workers, and his tenacity earned him the nickname Attila of the South. Every Mexican president around this time wanted to stamp out Zapata's forces and other far radical groups in the revolution. However, finding his troops was nearly impossible because they blended in with the ordinary peasants. The newspapers fed the public's fear by describing Zapata and his troops as savage barbarians. The negative press did not stop Zapata from marching to the capital. Other revolutionary leaders were marching to the capital, but part of the chaos of the Mexican Revolution was the lack of unity. Each revolutionary leader fought for his own interests. Only Villa and Zapata appear to have had sympathy for each other because both were peasants fighting for the radical side of the revolution.